Hey folks, another quick bit. This is uh, putting some threads on a piece of uh, steel rod. Uh, this is just an axle shaft from my welding cart. And this is actually a tip that I submitted to uh, Home Shop Machinist a long time ago, uh, back when I had a subscription. And uh, basically what you do is you take a piece of all thread or a cutoff bolt or whatnot, chuck it in your tailstock drill chuck, and then you adjust your die, in this case, you know, this is half 13, uh, so that it will thread on and reverse. And then what you do is you just butt it up to the end of your thread that you want to chase or cut. Lock your tail stock. Set that. And then uh, you throw a little thread cutting oil on there. All you have to do is just walk it off the end of the all thread. It helps if the uh, lathe chuck doesn't spin. Another thing you can do here is, well, actually you can't. <laughs> I was going to say, yeah, you could just power the chuck, but that's not going to work. What this does is it helps you get the the die on there straight if you don't have a die head or a die holder for your tailstock. You get your thread lead. So now that I've got it started, I'll just loosen that. Put the tailstock back, and I can slide my carriage out of the way. And then I can just try rotating that. <laughs> see this rod as being difficult. My truck isn't holding very well. There we go. That's better. That's playing ball. Throw a little more oil on it. Okay. Now 
And that is how you get a die started on a piece of rod without a tailstock die holder.